Right, so if you're producing content with AI, which by now you should because it allows you to generate content like this one right here, content that is brand tailored, that leverages AI to develop featured images, that has interactive table of, tables of contents, internal links in article videos that are not just relevant to the article itself, but are relevant to this section as well. Uh, bold dot words, internal links, external links, more in article images, um, more internal links, more external links. Again, if I skim through these, bullets when it makes sense, tables when it makes sense, again, through AI. And if you're leveraging these AI tools, it's great, whether that's ChatGPT or this one, tryjournalist.com, Journalist AI, which I'll leave a link in the description for. What you need to know if you're using tools like ChatGPT is that the content right here that's been generated right here is brand tailored, right? It's not just some generic AI content, right? All of the images, all the links, all the stuff right here is tailored to this brand, right? Again, we take a brand, I guess we take a brand, right? We connect the brand with Journalist AI and produce content, that's a piece of content, an article, tailored to this brand, right? With a featured image, with a table of contents, with proper structuring, right? With in-article images, in-article videos, internal links, so linking out from your article to other articles on your site or to other pages on your site, maybe to your homepage, maybe to your contacts page, right? External links, so linking out to external authoritative sources in your niche. For example, if this is an article about finance, we're going to link out to Bloomberg, TechCrunch, Investopedia, all those authoritative sources. Also, the anchor text, which is the links, the little text you click to go out to the links, whether that's an internal link or external link, it makes sense, right? It is in context with the paragraph, right? And it is in context, right? The, the actual text makes sense in accordance with what we're linking out to. On top of that, we add tables, we add um, bullets. We also add calls to action to your products or services down there. For example, if you're using content for a Shopify store, we're going to add a, an automatic, automatic sorry, call to action to uh, your brand's products. Or if you have a service offering, we're going to add a call to action to your service. So all this, again, 100% automated for you. Now, the good thing about this as well is that you can just go here and do the cure research automatically. So go here, create new monitor. I won't do it right now, but if I go here to edit, I just upload my website. It's going to evaluate my site, what I rank for, the competition, and come up with a bunch of keywords, right? A bunch of keywords that have low difficulty, so that in theory are easy to rank for with somewhat volume, with the uh, somewhat decent search volume, so monthly, ser monthly search volumes. But I can just go here, pick the ones I want, right? And then just have journalists generate content for me. So again, journalist right here is going to connect with my site's blog. They're going to do keyword research plus it's going to do generation plus it's going to do the publishing for me on autopilot. So it's going to be publishing articles to my blog every day, every hour, every month, every week, however you want to choose it. I'll go over that in just a second. These are individual articles. If we expand on these articles, so this is one of the articles. All these articles are going to have in a featured image, a table of contents, proper content structure, in article images, in article videos, internal links, external links, calls to action, bullets, tables, all this on autopilot. And if I go here real quick to the integrations, because I want to show you what your site could be, you can integrate with WordPress, Shopify, Ghost, Weeks, Webflow, Blogger, Zapier, or even an external API, right? So all these work for you. And on top of that, if you set up an auto blog, which is where it gets fun, you can set up the frequency. So how many articles you want to post every single day? You want to post 40 articles every day? You want to post 300 articles every six hours, right? Most people just do five articles every single week, right? But that's the true power of journalists. And on top of that, you can generate content in over 150 different languages. So if you're targeting the international markets, maybe Spain, Portugal, Turkey, uh, Greece, uh, India, right? Whatever it is, right? You can produce content in the local languages targeting these international markets, right? And again, as I said before, you just connect journalist, right here, journalist AI, connect it with your blog. It could be WordPress, Shopify, Blogger, whatever it is. It's going to do the keyword research for you. That's okay. The generation and then do the publishing on autopilot for you every single day. And each one of the articles is going to have internal links, external links, images, videos, bullets, calls to action, all this for you on autopilot. Super, super powerful. And on top of that, if you go here to brands and connect Journalist AI right here with your brand and note that your brand has multiple assets associated with it. For example, your YouTube channel, your Twitter, your Pinterest, your Instagram, your TikTok, right? Some documents, maybe some documents on your site, maybe some documents you have internally, uh, support docs, whatever it is, right? All, your brand is made out of multiple assets, right? These are all assets. And you, as the owner, as the founder, 
know all about this, right? You are the most knowledgeable person about your brand. Now, the thing is, is when you connect Journalist AI with your brand, now Journalist becomes the most knowledgeable, knowledgeable person about your brand. So it is as knowledgeable as you about your brand because you're giving it access to all these assets. And by access, I don't mean like anything dangerous, just give it front end access, right? But because Journalist now knows and is connected with your brand, the content that's gonna be producing is brand tailored, right? And on top of that, I can just show you here real quick, even with the content being brand tailored and all that, you can choose the tone of voice to match your brand, right? Funny, informal, academic, neutral, the creativity levels. You want to create content that's more creative or original, more correct or factual. This, again, will depend on how people perceive your brand, how your brand comes across, or you can even change the point of view. I won't go over all these because I want you to try it out, right? Just go to tryjournalist.com. I'll leave a link for this in the description. You have three articles for free. You can try all this out, right? Choosing between 150 different languages, right? Trying out the automatic uh, call to action, right? Trying out the automatic internal linking, trying out the automatic external linking, trying out all these images, sources. You can even add stock photos, Google license free photos. You can even add your custom images, so only using your own images or two AI image generation models, so DALI and Stable Diffusion. I recommend you try this one. It's pretty cool what it comes, comes up with. Uh, you can try this for yourself, adding the in article images, adding the videos. So if you just set this to enabled, We'll produce the article, we'll read through it, and then go on YouTube and figure out what's the best video we can include in this piece of content, so a relevant video. So super, super powerful. I recommend you try this out. And again, if you're leveraging AI content, you should be leveraging AI tools. And I often give this analogy right here, the stare analogy. Let's call the top here success. That's a dollar sign. If you're doing it all manually, right, you got to do the keyword research. Then you got to write the content. Then you got to figure out, go find the images to add to the content. Then you gotta do the same for the videos. Then you got there's actually more steps here, right? Because then you gotta figure out where is the best place inside of your article to add the internal links to. Then the same thing for external links. Figure out what's the best anchor text. Actually, first figure out what's the best place, then find the right anchor text and add the link, right? There's all these steps, right? With ChatGPT, I guess you, you start from up here because it does some of these things for you, mainly just the content generation. But with journalist AI, right, you skip all of these steps, right? Maybe you start from this this uh, step right here, not the top one. Because it does the keyword research for you. It does the generation for you. And then if you want, it does automatic publishing for you, right? It's gonna publish every single day, week, hour, month to your blog on autopilot. And that is brand tailored content. And on top of that, being content that is brand tailored, that knows and speaks your brand's tone of voice, it's gonna have images, videos, internal links, external links, calls to action, all this done automatically for you. Also, one more thing is that you can set up an indexer right here and it will automatically index all your content. So again, cure research, generation publishing, and then indexing. So we do all of this for you. And again, you can integrate with any of these platforms. So that's pretty cool. Again, I'll leave a link for this in the description. Try it out. I recommend you try out the advanced mode. Don't bother with these ones. These are cool, but the, these ones right here is where you're gonna um, take the more most advantage of the actual product. So again, I'll leave a link for this in the description. Try it out, let me know what you think. And if you don't like it, just go here to this little bubble and tell me, I didn't like the articles because of this, this, and that. And we'll give you more credits and we'll make sure that you are, you like whatever it is you're, you're generating. That's it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.